Hey, this is Harmony. When's the last time you caught yourself looking at another person's body and wishing that it was yours? Or wishing that yours could look that way? I have a story for you. I was on a hike the other day and two flowers caught my eye as I was hiking up this mountain. And one was pink and one was purple. And it was in the middle of nowhere and very unusual, so I stopped to look at them. And I bent down and was watching these two flowers, looking at these two flowers. And all of a sudden, this little purple flower started shaking. And it had condensation or drips of water running down its stem. So I got down a little bit closer. And, of course, not expecting an answer, I said, what's going on? And this little purple flower looks up at me and says, I can see in the reflection of your sunglasses that the flower next to me is pink, and I think it's prettier than I am. So I'm trying to be pink. And so it sat there trembling and sweating and trying and losing petals. And finally it gave up, and it was still purple. And it started sagging and was fatigued and sad. And a few minutes later, it propped itself up again and started to shake and sweat and try. And I said, what are you doing now? And it said, well, I can see in the reflection of your sunglasses that the flower next to me has more petals than I do. And so I'm trying to grow more. And so it tried and tried. And of course, it lost more petals in trying and finally gave up, exhausted. The purple flower will never be pink. And if it keeps trying and losing petals, it will never have as many petals. What are you doing with your life? Who are you comparing yourself to and trying to become? And what are you losing in the process? Love you. Be who you are and love who you are.